Welcome to WX Observations' review of the new Accurite Atlas home weather station. We're excited to tell you about some new features, our thoughts, and what consumers think about Accurite's latest technology. For more details on this model, or to see any of our comprehensive weather station reviews, please check us out at wxobservation.com. Let's get started. Accurite started off by designing an entirely new all-in-one sensor, aptly called the Atlas Weather Sensor. They've added some new instruments for a total of eight different weather sensors. They include a thermometer, hygrometer, wind vane, anemometer, rain collector, lightning detection sensor, UV index sensor, and a light intensity sensor. Accurite has a new high definition display for the Atlas, it's easy to see and looks great. It includes auto dim and sleep mode features as well as Accurite's weather ticker. There's an SD card slot for long-term data storage. And like most other Accurite weather stations, the indoor thermometer, hygrometer, and barometer are all located within the display module itself. Like other Accurite weather stations, the Atlas is well connected. It's wireless from the weather sensor to the display. It transmits up to 330 feet wirelessly on 433 MHz frequency. The included access module, shown in white in the photo, allows you to connect the Atlas to the cloud. You can upload weather data from your backyard to the MyAccurite app to set custom alerts or share data from your Atlas weather station with friends and family on the weather underground. The outdoor sensor array runs completely off battery power. If you saw the solar panels, they are actually for powering the aspirating fan that keeps the measurements more accurate. They are not used in powering any of the sensors. Accurite does, however, offer an optional AC adapter or remote battery pack, so there's no need for replacing batteries in the sensor when it's inconveniently mounted. We recommend the remote battery pack for this weather station. The link can be found below in the notes. The display unit is powered by an AC adapter. As you can see, the Atlas Weather Station accuracy stats are adequate for most weather enthusiasts, but might be lacking for professionals that require the utmost precision. At the price point of the Atlas Weather Station, these statistics are what we'd expect to see. There is a small mounting bracket included with the Atlas Weather Sensor. However, for most applications, we'd recommend trying to find a longer pole to mount it to for greater accuracy. It's made to mount to poles with one and a quarter inch diameter. There are also several commercially available mounting solutions that will work with the Atlas. I've included a couple in the notes below. So what do consumers have to say about the Accurate Atlas so far? Well, they love the new HD display that comes with it, along with the new sensors. There's also been a lot said about how easy it is to set up on the very popular weather underground. There are also some minor concerns. The small mounting piece makes it hard to mount high enough above the ground for good, accurate readings. The weather sensors are battery powered as opposed to solar powered. And lastly, there have been several comments on the accuracy of the lightning detection sensor. So what do we think about the Atlas Weather Station? We really like all the sensors included with the new Atlas. This is a suite of sensors you don't find anywhere else on a home weather station. The new display also looks great and functions as we'd expect, and the access module makes uploading your weather data to the web easy. Ultimately, we think this is a great weather station. We'll leave links below so you can read the full review at wxobservation.com or check the current price at Amazon.